Wafters are probably one of the most important baits in today's commercial fishing. And I'm gonna run you through all the little things that I've learned over the last couple of years why wafters are so deadly. The most important thing with a wafter is they actually float. If they don't float, they're no good as a wafter. So I can get all of these out of this tub here and every single one of them floats. That's mega, mega important because when you put your hook bait in with the wafter on, you can see that goes down. The hook, it sort of sits, it sort of just floats around on top of the hook. It's really, really important that that hook bait wafts around. So when a carp comes in your peg, the first thing it sucks up with that floating around is your hook bait. Another really, really important thing when you're wafter fishing is what hook and what size of hook you're using. And that's why I've got this tub of water here, is every time I go fishing with a method feeder, I'm using wafters. I've actually got a 16 kkm on there and it matches that eight mil wafter absolutely perfect. But just bear in mind, when you do go, make sure that it does that. Obviously, if you fish, if, if I, maybe if I put a 20 on there, it would still float. So make sure you match the hook with what wafter you've got on. Colour can make a big difference on each venue you go to. When I got to this lake today, it's really brown coloured. For me personally, it was like, I know probably the first bet I'm gonna put on is a bright colour like orange. But other venues you go to, if you're fishing with micro pellets around your method feeder or through your pellet feeder, use a colour which is like a pellet. It can make a big, big difference. I change on the day and one colour normally stands out the best. So just go through the motions and one colour will definitely put more fish in your net.